7th, 2022, uh, to the International Space Station on NASA's SpaceX Crew 4 mission. Uh, last year is September 28th. Uh, so, yeah, a little bit about the Dragon Freedom capsule. Dragon Freedom, uh, to the far left there is NASA astronaut Butch Wilmore. And as you can see, the crew is suited up in their space indeed daytime. And you're beginning to see that plasma trail as uh, Dragon re-enters the Earth's atmosphere. All of that is expected. We Coming from the WB-57 plane, that heat shield we can see doing magnificent work as it deploys. This view coming from the WB-57 high altitude plane. And there you see it on your screen, drogue deployment. Drogue descent rate normal. You can hear the crowd here. Visual on two healthy drogues. Continues to make its way back to planet Earth. The mains are quite a bit larger. You'll be able to notice the difference on your screen once they deploy, and they continue to ensure that the Dragon uh, spacecraft slows down even further. Big time this afternoon, and, and there we go. We have visual on four healthy mains. That view was from inside. Freedom copy. That view was from inside one of the buckets where the parachutes are located. So we see a great view there of the reefing on those parachutes. And as those parachutes, those main parachutes begin to inflate fully, four beautiful points as resting places for their arms. They were just in space moments ago. <laughs> so their arms were able to float freely. 400 meters. Florida. And splash down, crew nine back on Earth. And SpaceX Freedom, splash down. Good main release. Copy splash down. We see main shoots cut. Nick, Alex, Butch, Sunny, on behalf of SpaceX, welcome home. The water and onto the recovery vessel. Wow, we got a cute little pod of dolphins. It wasn't just one or two. The Dragon spacecraft. Now, here on your screen, we can see uh, dolphins actually <laughs> who want to come and play with uh, with Dragon. Now, one of the fast boats there in place working to assist the recovery team member. It's incredible. I just love these, these views. We really see them even better in daytime, but just seeing the recovery team work in tandem to uh, step through each step, uh, or excuse me, to step through each operation. Um, and, uh, you know, obviously they're, they're getting quick assists from the honorary part of the recovery team, those dolphins <laughs> uh, in the water there. Now the, the, recovery crew mem team member that is crawling around the Dragon spacecraft. Uh, earlier we saw a view where it was like a spider monkey pose. Um, we can see that individual now standing in the bucket where the main parachutes were stored while Dragon was on orbit. Obviously those main parachutes were utilized for splashdown today. Uh, they were deployed and cut from the Dragon capsule. Uh, and one of the fast boats, in the, uh, one of the other fast boats of the recovery team working to... The capsule here shortly once they get hoisted onto the recovery vessel, Megan. We can see that recovery vessel slowly but surely closing the distance there between... Oh, dolphin cam back again. <laughs> uh, we, can, we can see uh, that the dragon capsule and the recovery vessel, that distance is closing. Again, this is just one more step as we continue that articulate backwards and um, that's a good sign that we're we're getting even closer to pulling the capsule out of the water it will then uh, move forward so once securely on uh welcome aboard the recovery vessel recovery personnel are completing final checks And there you have it. The side hatch is open for the first time since September.
Um, and, and there we do see Crew 9, some happy waves, smiles all around back on Earth. Oh, looks like we're getting our next crew member here. That is none other than Sonny Williams. Big smile, big waves. She, like her other crew members, now uh, will be assisted onto the mobility aid. There we have it, some waves, some thumbs up, and some smiles. We're getting some views of him now as he egresses or exits the spacecraft. Once again, some elation and cheers there from Butch Wilmore.